，为大家介绍两千年奥斯卡最佳动画奖。为什么要介绍两千年的时候那么久，就是十四年前的一部动画呢？因为它到今天为止，没有人超越它的创意。这部动画呢，它的片名是《老人与海》，就是海明威的小说，但是它的创作方法是以在玻璃上头刷子、手指一笔一笔画出来的动画，所以跟现在在电脑上头画是不一样。总共画了两万九千多片的玻璃画作。最后完成了总共两年多的时间，完成了二十分钟的动画短片，最终获得了两千年奥斯卡最佳动画片奖。即使过了十四年，回头看他的时候，都觉得《老人与海》这部动画到现在为止，用电脑画出来的，或是宫崎骏用水彩画出来的，还是跟他很不相同。Supper. Uh, uh, uh. Wake up. We're gonna have supper. I'm not very hungry. Come on, eat. You can't fish and not eat. I have. You'll not fish without eating while I'm alive. <laughs> Then live a long time and take care of yourself. Santiago,、huh? I could go with you again. We've made some money. No, no, you're on a lucky boat now. I know you did not leave because you doubted me. It's been eighty-four days since I caught a fish. Stay with them. It was Papa who made me leave. I am a boy, and I must obey him. I know, but it's quite normal. When I was your age, I was before the mast on a square-rigged ship that ran to Africa. I have seen lions on the beaches in the evening. Yeah, I know. You told me. Tomorrow is going to be a good day with this current. Where are you gonna go? Far out, so as to come in when the wind shifts. Santiago. How old was I when you first took me in a boat? Five. And you nearly were killed when I brought the fish in too green. And he nearly tore the boat to pieces. Can you remember? I remember everything from when we first went together. Good luck, old man.
第八十五天，老渔民依旧乐观的出海。这一次，他似乎转运了。Oh, 海上漂流了三天两夜，靠着顽强的意志，他战胜了孤单、疼痛和饥饿，终于征服了这条大鱼。啊啊在船上，在返航的途中，尸体的血引来了海里的鲨鱼，贪婪的抢食老渔民的战利品。老渔民用尽所有的力气搏斗，还是不敌大自然的无情作弄。等到他返航时，跟着他的只剩下一副残破的骨架。Did they search for me? Of course. How much did you suffer? Plenty. You know, I missed you. Now we fish together again. I am not lucky anymore. 纵使在命运的面前显得如此渺小而脆弱，人类从未屈服放弃，向命运妥协。海明威曾经是战地记者，看尽世态炎凉，总以简洁精炼的笔调。象征性的叙事风格，传达人生必须坚强的信念
，老人与海为他赢得了一九五三年的普利兹奖和隔年的诺贝尔文学奖，成为当代文学中备受推崇的经典。